In today's video, we will check out the Realme Buds wireless. So let's talk about them in all aspects like build quality, comfort, features, battery life, sound quality, and let's find out if you should spend your money here. Hey, what, what, what's up? My name is Shivam and before getting to the video, if you could leave a like and subscribe to the channel, it would be highly appreciated. And by the way, if you want to find out the best deal on this earphone, you can check out the first link down below in the description. So Realme Buds wireless were launched last year and I haven't got any chance to test these out. But today is the day when I finally got the time to make this review about the Realme Buds wireless. So before getting into whether they are worth it, let's go through a quick unboxing to see what this thing came up with. So here is the packet from Amazon and as you can see, it is not very interesting to see. So let's just quickly unbox this. Let's do it this way. So here is the retail box. As you can see, it says Realme on the top and the image of the earphone itself. It comes in three different colors, black, yellow, orange, and teal. So that's it. And below this, it says Realme Buds Wireless. On the side, it says Realme on both of these sides. And on the back, we have some features of these earphones. That is magnetic control, 11.2 millimeter bass boost driver, 12 hours of playback, flexible necklace, Bluetooth 5.0 and IPX4 water rating. And below this, you can see the MRP of the device, which is 2000 rupees, but they sell it actually less on Amazon. So you can check it out from the links down below in the description. For now, I'm really excited to check it out. So let's just quickly unbox these earphones. So let's go. How should we do it this time? Flip, okay. So here are the earphones sitting nicely in the package, as you can see. So let's just quickly take them out. Let's put them aside. Let's see what else do we have in the box. We don't need this now. Now let's open this up. So here we get this tiny micro USB cable. Other than that, we get extra ear tips for precise fit. And last but not the least, we get user manuals and how to get started. But that was the unboxing of the Realme Buds wireless, but now let's test them out and see how they perform. First, let's talk about the design and build quality. For the design and build quality, these are neckband style of earphones, which is quite trending right now. Not much like the true wireless earphones. And for the aesthetics, they are sporty looking earphones. On the Buds wireless, we have this black, yellow, teal and orange color options. So you can pick whichever suits your style, but have to say the black and yellow is one of my favorite. By holding and using this earphone it feels premium and i will say the device feels like a polished one you will find the materials to be great and high quality and overall the build quality is looking fantastic i don't think you will face any build quality issues but hey these are electronic products so you can't trust them now comfort and fitting is a vital aspect when buying any earphones or headphones because you don't want to be stuck with an earphone which you can't wear for more than a minute so be careful talking about the fitting realme have these earphones ear hooks which means they are not going to slip out of your ears every now and then so if you intend to use it in running or workout it should be fine also these ear hooks are removable so if you don't want to use it you can easily remove them but talking about the comfort they are comfortable but not that much i've seen much more comfortable earphones like the oneplus bullets wireless z but these are average in terms of comfort i had to do a quick fix I changed these ear tips from one of my earphones and now they are perfect. I can now easily use them for eternity. On the feature side, there is quite a lot. First of all, we get Bluetooth 5.0, which is awesome. But if you are the 1% who wants to connect multiple devices simultaneously, then you can't do that here. But what you do get is the fast pair, which means the earphones will connect swiftly to your smartphone or laptop. Magnetic earbuds are also there, which makes them convenient to carry. And you can easily manage them if you're not in the mood of using them. And not just that, it also has auto on and off, which means the earphones will automatically turn on when you detach them and will turn off when you attach them again. It saves a ton of battery, plus you don't have to hold any button for a few seconds to turn them on or off. Now, speaking of battery, there is fast charging feature on the birds, which means if you charge the device for 10 minutes, it will give you around 100 minutes 
minutes of playback. We will talk more about the battery life in a moment. But for making things durable, we have IPX4 water rating as compared to IPX5, which is very common on most of these earphones in 2020. But still, we can use these in workout and walk in rain without thinking twice. Getting to the battery life on the Buds Wireless, we have 110 milliamp hour battery, which can be charged in one and a half hours. And then you are supposed to get 12 hours of playback. And similarly, in my testing, I was able to get around 10 and a half hour of playback, which is awesome for any kind of wireless earphones. So even if you are a heavy user, I don't think you have to charge more than once a day. If you do so, then you might stop hearing these videos in few years. Please don't do this. I need you. The earphones have inline buttons, which include play, pause button and volume rocker. So there is nothing that you can't do from these buttons. But one thing to note here is that the buttons are placed on the neck band, which is not apt place and it becomes somewhat hard to use. But I think you will totally get away with it. But speaking of the audio quality of the inline mic, this is what it sounds like. This is the audio quality test of the inline mic on the Realme Buds wireless. So this is something that the person you hate and still talking to would hear your lovely voice. Now getting to the point for what you all guys have been waiting for and that is the sound quality. One thing I want to get out of the way is that the Realme Buds wireless are bass oriented earphones. So if you hate earphones that pump out a lot of bass, you should look for something else like the OnePlus Bullets Wireless Z review right up there. But if you do love bass, then you should continue. So everyone in India love bass. No one can deny that there is only 1% of idiots like me who like balanced sounding earphones. But taking you guys in perspective, I want to say that the sound quality, which includes bass of the Realme Buds wireless is great. They produce good mids and highs, but as you are going for the boosted bass, you will have to sacrifice some mids and highs because these tiny drivers on any earphones can't keep up with all the frequency range at the same time. But talking about the bass, they are superb. It produces good amount of bass so if you listen to any bass heavy genre like hip-hop trap r&b which is my personal favorite then you will definitely love these but one thing i don't like about the sound quality of these earphones is that the bass is not as clean as it should be i mean if it could be more smoother i will definitely fall for them something like the boat rock is 255 pro they have very pronounced bass you can also watch my comparison of these two earphones Oop. But talking about the price, Realme Buds wireless will cost you 1800 rupees, which is the range for most of these neckband earphones. So it's decently priced, I would say. But for my final verdict, if you're looking for a wireless neckband earphone, then I think you will be satisfied with the Buds wireless. And taking into account how many of you commented on my last video about how much you love these earphones. So from that perspective, I think you will be good with these earphones. So if you want to check out these earphones for yourself, you can check out from the links down below in the description but that's been it guys that was today's video my review and hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did just click the like button below share this video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet until then stay safe bye bye